the innovative tech gear company Nothing has finally confirmed the Nothing Phone 2. And not only did they confirm it, but it's also coming very soon. They said summer of 2023. If we take a look at their tweet from May 3rd, we'll see that there they included not only a hint at a premium, a much more premium phone, which the CEO of the company previously said, they also confirmed it's going to be called the Nothing Phone 2, and they also gave us this three-second video clip um, that, honestly, I'm not 100% sure if this tells us much, other than it is going to have a very similar look and feel to the phone, uh, but it is going to be a little bit different. So compared to the Nothing Phone 1, you can see a very similar kind of polka dot type of material alongside a red LED. Um, the difference here is there, it, it definitely does look different. So we're going to get a little bit of a redesign. Um, that LED is now kind of an elongated shape versus the uh, little, little circle. Um, so it's definitely going to be different. The one thing that really intrigues me in this is if you look over on the very far edge of the picture of this video, it either looks like like the glass panel isn't there yet or or this is there's a rounded edge there. Um, I'm not sure what this is gonna look like, but I, I can't imagine it's probably anything too crazy. Uh, probably just that we can't see the whole picture here. So let's take a recap really quick on what we know already about the Nothing Phone 2. Um, any leaks, rumors, anything that's been confirmed by the company, which isn't a lot as of yet. As well as let's take a look at what me personally, as a newer owner, a recent owner of the Nothing Phone 1, um, what I like and don't like and what I absolutely need out of the Nothing Phone 2 to make it an insta-purchase, a pre-order type of thing for me. Um, we'll get into what I'm really hoping to see out of the Nothing Phone 2. So as we mentioned before, CEO of Nothing, Carl Pei, did uh, already say in a previous uh, statement that the Nothing Phone 2 was going to be a more premium device. And that is something that was confirmed by the tweet on May 3rd, uh, premium. Uh, this is something that is, uh, I, I think they were going for a mid-range phone with the Nothing Phone 1, and now they want something that can be, compete with the highest uh, standards of phones out there, which I'm really, really excited about. I really do love my Nothing Phone 1, and honestly, how premium it feels for that you know, $400, $500 price range. I'm really excited to see what they can do with a more premium phone. That being said, with a more premium device usually comes a bit more of a premium price tag as well. Um, there are a lot of rumors going around right now on how much it might actually cost. A lot of people are hoping for sub $700 or even $600 US. Um, I think that that is pushing it a little bit, uh, but that would be pretty awesome. More good news on the Nothing Phone 2 is that they did confirm that it is coming to the United States. It will be available in the US market. Not sure which carriers yet. Nothing has been confirmed as far as that goes. It might still only be a Nothing Fulfillment Center here in the US, but it will be available uh, right away. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to get it into a lot more hands here in the United States so that we can get more phones like this. And again, none of the specs of the Nothing Phone 2 have been confirmed as of yet. We have heard that it will be getting a Snapdragon 8 processor. We're not sure which one. Um, there are some rumors about it being a Gen 1. There are some rumors about it being a Gen 2. There are also some rumors about it being a previously unannounced version of the chip. Um, either way, uh, that Snapdragon 8 is an amazing processor and I think would be an amazing addition to an already awesome phone. Most rumors are still citing about a 5,000 milliamp battery for this new phone. Probably around the same screen size, um, AMOLED display, probably 8 and 12 gigabytes of RAM, 128, 256 gigabyte models just like the current. Maybe an offer of a 512 gigabyte model, but really I think honestly the biggest changes we're going to see are in that chipset 
getting a much faster, more efficient chip is going to be huge, as well as the changes in design. And that's going to bring us to really what I want to see out of the Nothing Phone 2. First and foremost, I want a new design. I want something even better. I want not even, not an incremental step. I want another feature. I want another a uh, version of glyphs something that can really change the way that people think about and use their phones um, i think the glyphs were really cool a really really great feature for some people that use that type of thing but i want something that is going to really just change the phone again just completely change it once we see what the actual design on this phone is going to look like. If we see a brand new feature like Glyphs coming to this Nothing Phone 2, that will make it an Insta pre-order, Insta buy for me. Other things that are going to make me want to buy this phone, if we can get some improved glass on the front, um, honestly, the phone doesn't feel bad, but every once in a while, I feel like uh, it's the glass, it's the material it's that, that makes the phone feel a little sluggish or not quite as up to par as some of these other premium phones. When I switch back to my Pixel 7, um, it really, the glass feels really, really good. I don't know if it's the curved glass versus the flat glass. I'm not sure what it is, but um, having that improvement on the front glass would be really, really nice for me. Um, I also think that if we get a Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 or better or equivalent type of processor, uh, in this phone, that will be an insta pickup for me. I really, really do like my Nothing phone. I think it's super fun. And to be able to have that kind of newest flagship chips in there, the extra battery and benchmarks that this chip is putting out is incredible. To be able to have that in such a unique phone, insta buy for me. The other thing that's going to make this really, really easy to pick up is if it is that sub $600 price range. I mean, how many phones can you pick up for sub $600? Different sources are saying that it could be $600 or less. Man, that that seems like such an easy pickup for me uh, to be able to add to the collection, to be able to try a brand new phone at that kind of price point that is going to be more premium than the current nothing phone. That makes me want to instantly pick this one up. I've really grown to like the Nothing Company, what they do, the, the quality of products that they have put out so far. Um, if, if it's a, is, as inexpensive as some of these rumors are, uh, are saying that it's going to be, it's going to be a really easy one to pick up for me. So that is about what we know about the Nothing Phone 2 right now. Make sure you subscribe to my channel here because if there is any other news, if any of those couple things come true, I will definitely be pre-ordering this device and you'll be able to see it right here as soon as I have it. Otherwise, what would it take in a Nothing Phone 2 for you to want to pick that up? Let me know down in the comments and I will let you know what I think about those features as well. Thanks for watching.